delivering corn to an ingredient plant in Bedford Park. They're known for Argo starch is their, their biggest um, product that they manufacture. A lot of people may recognize that when you're in the grocery store. Uh, we're fortunate in northeastern Illinois to have a number of different markets that we can sell our grain to, ingredient being one of them. Uh, but we have a river market and we have also an ethanol plant market that we can deliver to. So it really comes down to whoever's paying the, the best price on that day that you want to sell it. This plant wouldn't be here if you didn't have the population. It also allows for diversification within operations. Uh, so it's just a matter of loading the grain on the farm, uh, on my truck, and then driving in here takes about an hour they weigh my truck so they can determine how many bushels of corn or grain, whatever I'm, whatever I'm delivering to the elevator, it's, it's always weighed. A typical bushel of corn is 56 pounds. And then moisture um, is 15%. If it's above that, you get docked on the price. Uh, they don't give you any premium for it being less moisture. Uh, same way with test weight. If you haul in 60 pound corn, you don't get any premium because it's over 56. You do get more bushels on the truck. So if that truck load that we hauled today weighed 56 pounds, was just shy of 950 bushels, if we put 60 pound corn on it, it'd probably be closer to 1,000 bushels for the same volume. So that's one factor. Um, after they take their sample, they decide whether or not they're gonna let me dump it. Because there have been times where you get spoilage or damage and they will decline to unload a load. I have seen that happen, none of mine. Um, so then they'll unload it uh, and then they put it into their storage facility to utilize the grain later in their plan. And after you unload, you get your empty weight and you leave and in a few days I'll, I'll get a direct deposit in my bank account.